Hi guys, Mandy here in Dawson. Uh, we're kind of late to the party for a theme Thursday, but I had the most craziest day ever. Um, this morning at the bus stop with my littles, um, there was a stray dog and nobody uh, was able to take him and find his owner. Uh, everybody had crazy things to do today, I guess. And uh, so I was like, well, I'll take him. <laughs> so if you follow my Instagram, you saw the adorable little um, Bentley, his name ended up being. Um, he was a basset hound and uh, he ended up, I had him for the whole day. Um, I had him at eight o'clock. I walked all the, or 8.30, sorry. I walked around the block several times um, because he kept pulling me in one direction. And I thought for sure that's where he lived. Um, and I was hoping like, you know, someone would recognize him, but nobody seemed to know him. I called the Humane Society. I put pictures up on the SPCA and um, uh, by like uh, groups for lost and found animals in my town and all sorts of things and nobody seemed to respond to any of that and uh, it was crazy so I had this little guy with me all day I had to give him a bath because he rolled in poo and uh, finally when um, my when Jordan came home we took him physically took him to the Humane Society and I was so worried wary <laughs> wary about that because I was afraid if we left him there that you know if nobody came to claim him like he'd be euthanized like that's what I was afraid of so um luckily when we got there they had by then had the a call that the dog was missing somebody was looking for him and they happened to just be up the road <laughs> they were at the grocery store um so we ran him over there and uh they were very thankful um, i told them i gave him a bath and and they were happy to to have him back but he was adorable and it was just a crazy crazy day because i was so worried that i was going to have to because I was didn't have the heart to leave him there um, I actually had called a local um, animal shelter and I asked the woman because I wasn't sure if I was doing the right things I wasn't sure if I was supposed to call like animal control or something like I didn't know the I've never um, taken in a stray dog before and I said like what should I be doing and she said no you're doing everything right and they will actually ask you um, to hold on to him unless you can't um, and I was worried that I wouldn't be able to hold on to him because he wouldn't stop whining Ugh, he wanted he knew he had a family out there and even though I gave him lots of love and treats and he snuggled me good for a while he still wanted to be home but anyways Bentley the basset hound is back home with his family and if I see him again at least I know where to go <laughs> um, so that was my day and tomorrow I'm going to have to I was so prepared to have like a relaxing day today too it was so funny because I cleaned for the interview right so my house was spotless laundry was pretty well taken care of and I was like you know what I'm going to just relax today and watch some Netflix or something fun and then boom <laughs> crazy day of running around trying to find this dog's mummy but we found him found her them <laughs> so Dawson looks adorable I'm gonna take some pictures and make sure I get some on Instagram um, this is a special gown that Kari sent with him when um, she re reborned him um, she wanted to send him in something special um, to make it a little extra special because she was sad that I had gone through all the craziness I went through with Dawson and him being a disaster. So I love this um, gown very much. It's very special to me. And every time I put it on him, I think of Kari and all the love she put into him. So that's my theme Thursday gown. This was a, a great choice. I, I wish I had more gowns. They, they never put a lot of um, gowns out. And I know Carter's did put out that one set, like that flowery print one. Um, but when I went to um, my Carter's, uh, I think they, own, they they had like a random size of it. I it was one size or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I just wasn't 100% into that. I got to find something fun. I remember Emma had a, a Joe Fresh made them when Emma was a baby. I remember I had an orange one. It was pretty cool. Gosh, I wish I had kept some of the stuff. Anyways, I'm totally rambling now and I'm totally exhausted. So I'm going to get to get my littles to bed and get to bed soon. So I will see you guys again another time. Take care, everybody. Bye.